Hi, my name is... Hi, my name is Willa... Hi, my name is... My name is Willem and this is KNB. We would like to thank everyone that has subscribed to get us to 1,000 subscribers. We couldn't have done it without you. If this is your first time here, click the subscribe button and keep coming back for new and exciting videos. When I ask you to picture in your head the most dangerous animal in the world, what do you imagine? Lions, tigers, bears? Oh my! Well, you would be way off base. The most dangerous animal in the world is actually an insect smaller than a dime. It's a mosquito! Yes, that tiny little pest that buzzes around your head all summer. They have been on planet Earth a lot longer than we have. They have been around for about 200 million years. That's right, since the dinosaurs. Arr. You've seen Jurassic Park, right? <coughs> that bug in the Yellowstone? That was a mosquito. Mosquitoes cause over a million deaths a year by spreading diseases like malaria, the Zika virus, dengue fever, and the West Nile virus. Most of the cases are in warmer and poorer countries. They don't have the same resources and funding to have a mosquito control program. Also, they don't have cold enough winters to halt the increase of the population. Did you know that the female mosquito is the only one that bites? Both male and female mosquitoes get their food from the nectar of plants. The female mosquitoes actually use the blood that they steal from humans and animals to give protein to their eggs. Each female mosquito can lay 50 to 500 eggs at a time. Holy eggs! And she can lay those eggs up to 10 times in her life. That's a lot of mosquitoes! Them pesky critters need water to lay their eggs, and it needs to be still water, like a puddle, a pond, or a bird bath. Try to eliminate any standing water around your house, and that can cut down on number of those mosquitoes. Have you ever wondered why mosquito bites itch? It's because of their spit. That's right, when a mosquito bites you, they bite you with two needles. One needle injects you Ouch. with a spit that contains an anticoagulant. This prevents the blood from clotting and stopping the flow of blood. And the other Our one is to suck your blood. I do not say blah, blah, blah. <laughs> your body reacts to the spit as an intruder and tries to fight it off by sending extra white blood cells. It's like an allergic reaction, and that's what causes that little red bump. It makes it itch so crazy. Well, how do we get rid of those pesky buggers? The best way for all of us to limit the number of mosquitoes is to get rid of standing water around your house. Mm -hmm. Make sure you use bug spray and wear long sleeves and long pants. I know, you're like, it's summer. And luckily, most mosquitoes are active during dusk, nighttime, and dawn. You still have the day to sport t-shirts and shorts. Some might think a bug zapper is a good idea. Do, 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 do. Oh! Not so much. Most of the bugs that bug zappers kill are not mosquitoes. Oops. They kill a lot of moths and other bugs that are not harmful and that pollinate in the nighttime. There's actually a positive side to having mosquitoes. Wait, what? I know, I was shocked too. First, they are a food source for many animals, like fish when they're in the larva stage, and then birds, bats, and then spiders when they grow to adulthood. 
They help pollinate plants as they feed, and now scientists are looking into ways that mosquito saliva can be used to cure some diseases and to help with medical conditions. We're sorry, but it's going to be a long time before we admit that mosquitoes are a positive species to have around. But you never know. Yeah, you never know. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. What? What? Ow. Stop. No, you stop. Ha, 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 ha.